out there in comic book land, this is my weekly LCS haul. I know I'm a little late. This should have been done yesterday, but didn't have enough money. So I had to go today. And I wound up spending a little bit more than I wanted to because I picked up a couple of other comics that I wouldn't have picked up yesterday. And I went through their sale bin. They're having like a back issue sale for a dollar each. And so I picked up about three or four of those, which I will do at the end of the video. So, as usual, DC, Marvel, Image, Small Press. Let's get started. First off, Batman number 92. I think this is the beginning of the Joker War. I think. That's the A cover. I have the cardstock variant B cover. With punchline on it. I wanted to get the one in 25, but they were asking $40 for it. And so I said, no. Next. Batman Secret Files. Number three. Sorry about all the glare on this. My next one is Batman's Grave, number seven, the variant cover. I love this cover. Next, I have Batman the Adventures Continue, number one. Take it as based off the animated series. And my last DC Joker 80th anniversary. And this is which variant cover is this? This is uh, I don't know. Oh, it's the two. It's the two thousands. It's like ten bucks. That is it for DC. I have no new Marvels. I don't think any Marvels came out this week, but I probably wouldn't have had any anyway. So on to Image. This is one of the ones that I wouldn't picked up that I wouldn't have gotten. Uh, Adventure Man number one. It is really thick and regular price. This is more of an impulse buy. Um, I don't know if I'm going to like it, but... What the hell? Next and last image. Philadelphia, number six. Pretty good series so far. And like I said, last image. On to Boom Studios. Something that I am loving. And it was supposed to be a six-part miniseries, but it sold so well that they just... Yep. We're going to make it an ongoing. And this is the, I think, the second book by him this week that I've got. Something that's Killing the Children, number seven. Very good book. That's it for Boom Studios. And the last book that I got this week. It's from AWA Upshot Comics. It is a five-part miniseries. Old Haunts. I saw in the comic book channels polls that he got that book. Looks like something that I might like. So I picked it up. I hope it's good. Anyway, that is it for the new comics. Let me show you the things that I got in uh, the dollar bins. This, these were for a dollar each. Seasons of the Reaper, number one. No idea what it's about, but hey, look, I mean, a bunch of people with axes going up into a cabin out in the woods. Talking about Reapers. Hell. 
can't be that bad. And this is a great deal. This is only one dollar. Superman Last Stand of Krypton. It's a buck. And it's written by Steve Guerrero, G E R R E R. Don't know who he is, but hey, all right. Um, this is an image, Secret Identities, number one. No idea what it's about. Uh, this is Ash, number one. No idea who he is, but hey. And this is the last, ow, that hurts, of the dollar comics. And it looks like it could be interesting. The Incredible Hulk versus the Mighty Thor. Or, or the Unworthy Thor. The Incredible Hulk versus the Unworthy Thor. It's a return to planet Hulk. Look at that. That's a pretty thick stack. And that's it for this week. The book that I want to read the most, that I'm going to, the book of the week that I want to save for last to read is Batman number 92. And let's see, cover of the week. Try not to use variant covers. So I can't use that one. So cover of the week. That one's pretty good. All right. That's it for this week. What do you think? Did you get anything that I got? Do you have any suggestions for me? And uh, most of all, enjoy your comics.